didn't see you there. Hello, YT. My name is Loud Mime, and I'm a streamer and YouTuber, and I stream in Facebook Gaming and Twitch, and I'm going to teach you how to stream with just one monitor, right? So, not everyone is willing to buy a dual monitor setup just to stream uh, as a beginner, so I'm going to teach you how to use transparent Twitch chat overlay app and Streamlabs together to basically integrate everything that is interactive within streaming, which is uh, viewings and your chats, your stars, your likes, and everything in just one monitor. You don't have to close your game, you don't have to use your phone, you don't have to compromise your streaming just because you want to check your live dashboard and everything like that. So what I want you to do is download Streamlabs. I want you to choose whatever Facebook gaming page you have and I want you to set up everything that you want but, but I'm here to teach you the basics so it would be better to just leave it leave it as be and then later customize it so what I want you to uh, do is look at the links down below I'm going to link everything that you need to download and what instructions that I may have during this video so my first instruction is I want you to download transparent Twitch chat overlay. So this is just not only for Facebook gaming, but you can use it in Twitch and YouTube streaming and etc. And I want you to go to the version and then go to the links down below. It's either a zip file or an installer. So just run the installer, click next until it finishes, but remember the app requires you to restart your computer so things uh, might not work if you don't restart so I recommend you restart and then let's proceed with Streamlabs. What I want you to do is open the dashboard and just leave it there. Later we will go back to that. So let's search for Twitch chat overlay. So the first thing that you will see in Twitch chat overlay in uh, at the beginning of it is its settings so let's go to widgets and then click this link and this link is helpful for everything that you will want to do so this is the link let me just move that there so I recommend you to read everything if you want to maximize your Facebook gaming experience with your viewers because it teaches you how to put any widget in your screen. So let's say we want to put chat. Let's put chat. You want uh, you playing Valorant, you want to put chat there so you can respond real time. And you click the link here and it will lead you to this uh, in the dashboard which is the chat box so I want you to copy this and then paste it right here and then press create so what this does is it automatically makes a window that puts your chat here when you're live so whenever you can just uh, tinker here like for example you want this a little bit bigger or you want it like to put on the side you could like uh, choose whatever spot it goes so the chats will appear here in real time so this is amazing because you don't have to alt tab or close the, the game so I recommend that you check it out in a sense that if if it works in full screen or windowed full screen mode because not every game works that it shows this overlay so try it out maybe windowed full screen mode first then check if if the overlays in the shot overlay app appears and next up is if you want to uh, know if someone has followed you or liked you in Facebook gaming just copy that again the widget URL and then paste it and then create so what this does it it transfers your Streamlabs 
uh, data in Facebook because you logged in your Streamlabs, right? And it places everything right up here. So this is amazing again because you don't have to add that. And then another thing is your viewers. So you want to know if someone is actually watching you without looking at your phone or alt tabbing. So copy again, then create, and then boom, your customized or your set up the viewer widget has appeared. So how do I remove? the so yeah it appears like this you have a game here and it appears like that how do i remove the borders now that i'm so you just have to right click on the taskbar and then you just have to toggle borders so it might not work at first but here it goes so it, it will appear like that spot on and no gimmicks it just appears as is so this is amazing this is a game changer for people who don't have dual monitor so what else could I teach you well you could also stream with your viewers and your comments uh, in the chats in Facebook gaming right here with shadow play so shadow play allows you to broadcast live and it shows your viewers and your comments in Facebook gaming in a HUD but it's very limited that's why I recommend twitch chat overlay because it's a friendly beginner app that allows you to view everything that you need right in your monitor so so once you place your widgets right here on the screen so this is called widgets it cannot be dragged so when I drag it, it doesn't move. So that's the amazing part of this. But if you want to move it, just toggle borders again, right click, and then you could move it. It's just amazing. So just explore the Streamlabs app and know what type of sizes, customizations you want to do. And you could now stream with just one monitor so i hope this is a helpful tutorial for you because it definitely helped me when i started streaming i'm not using this now but i do admire those streamers who want to stream even though they just have one monitor so i stream at again twitch facebook gaming and the links are down below just like and subscribe because it really helps me bring my content towards others that really need this kind of help and i also want to entertain you guys with this types of uh, stuff i do at my room and just uh remember to drop a comment down below if you have anything that also helps and maybe you'd help a streamer out there and it would make their day so see you again next time bye